So let us try to solve this problem by the method we just discussed. And that method says r is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab cos theta root over and tan phi, <coughs> tan phi is equal to a sin theta upon, upon b plus a cos theta or a cos theta plus b, a cos theta plus b, okay. Now, if this is minus Q and this is Q and this is Q, we first should see what is the orientation of the force such that they are co-initial, right? So, so we have to find this. So, here the force is in this direction. It will be attractive. And here it will be in this direction. Incidentally, the magnitude of all the forces will be the same. Why? Because the interacting charges and their distances are the same. Right? Right? So, so this is the force here. So, what is the magnitude of that force? Let us try to understand magnitude of that force is Q into Q K Q Q upon L square. Correct? So, that is K Q square upon L square. So, this is a force. This is a force F, which is that. No, uh, because negative sign is taken into account. We are not considering the negative sign because that is taken into account by the way they are oriented. So it's taken care of, no? Now when you are dealing with this, you do not take positive or negative. You just take the length. Understand? So, so that heading is gone. and But that is factored in. Here, this force will be like that and this force will be like this. So you understand negative has been factored in automatically. Now what is the angle? So here the resultant force on force on charge at A is equal to. So this is A, this is B, this is C. Force on charge at A is equal to what F square plus F square. Both, both the force magnitudes are the same plus 2 F into F into cos 60. So and cos 60 is half. So this is F square plus F square and this is 2 F square into half is F square, right? So this is 3 F square. So this is root 3 F. We get that point. And since they are equal, it will be, it will be a bisector. So it will be bisecting it. So it is root 3f in the minus j direction. Here force on charge at B, force on charge at B is equal to what? This force will be going away like that. This force is getting attracted like that and their sum, since they are equal forces, their sum will be a bisector. So, so, so my resultant will be at an angle of 60 degree and will be equal to that. that. That also we know. However, we should be applying the formula F square. What is the angle? The angle is this 120 degree. Correct? Here the angle was 60 degree the smaller of the two angles okay so <coughs> it is f square plus f square plus 2 f into f into cos 120 so it is 2 f square plus 2 f square into minus half so it is 2 f square minus f square which is f square root over which is f okay this is pointing vertically downwards. Correct? You will have to tell that. This is making an angle at an angle of this is how much? This is 60 and this is 60 of 120 degree from positive direction of x-axis. 